communities in these areas, they heavily rely on uh, tourism as the main source of livelihood. The COVID-19 impact on tourism, most villages, uh, and especially women, uh, that work in the hotels, they lose their job. This project was initiated to try and assist them, you know, in uh, not only uh, to generate income, but also as a food source, particularly the mothers to uh, confidently uh, provide for their family. We can help motivate other women in the village to start their own business by utilizing resources. Some of the land we can we can utilize because because of uh, it's muddy or swampy. By digging a pond, we can do fish farming. At the same time, we are using this uh, type of land to to support the community. Eh? One of the most important uh, aspect of uh, agriculture in Fiji is trying to get food on the table, and that's uh, where food security comes in. This is one of the projects that will encourage them to show that this is possible. You know. They can also sell their fish and chicken so that they can earn income. It addresses uh, the nutrition need of the community because uh, there is an epidemic uh, um, of NCDs in Fiji currently. The activities we will um, work with the women and uh, in terms of monitoring uh, and helping them out uh, to ensure that uh, the sustainability of the project, the investment, uh, the returns are being uh, realized. Uh, currently, we have 15 members who are selected to run this project with the help of our Turang Nikoro and the village members. Seeing that sense of uh, achievement, that sense of accomplishment in terms of acquiring information and knowledge to uh, develop or to take the project further was a highlight for me. The women themselves would be uh, empowered to make decisions and uh, you know have a voice, uh, have a voice in the meetings, in the village council meetings. They are confident because they have something to give back. The project has taught me a lot in terms of uh, leadership skills. Uh, the first one is uh, the ability to network with, uh, within WLI, with uh, agencies, government agencies that shared the same outcome as the project, right down to the provincial office that identify us, the communities that in need of the assistance. Uh, we have future plans for poultry chicken, uh, not only to sell within our community, but to sell to other communities in rural areas who are also affected. My plan so far now is to run my own business after this project is finished. Uh, I really do acknowledge the learning and the experience with the WLI, uh, you know. Now, most importantly, the network was tremendous and used the areas of expertise to implement our objectives. They taught us by working together, hand in hand, we can move anything forward.